Oh, hey, Miss Amanda. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. You hesitated. Is everything okay? <laughs> Just nervous. I'm with a big star. Yeah, no, you're not. Well, maybe. I don't know. I so, am. Uh, uh, hey, uh, welcome back, everybody. This is my second interview this week. Uh, I'll admit I'm more excited about this one than Wukash. <laughs> His is already over, so he won't watch this one. So, uh, I'm here with Miss Amanda from the desktop team. Hi, everyone. Uh, Amanda Kofsky, right? Yes. Oh, and I'm going to try something. I've always wondered if this will work. The stars at night are big and bright. Deep in the heart of Texas. See, I knew it. I knew it would work. I saw that in Pee Wee's Big Adventure. <laughs> so, that was really cool. Yes, so uh, Miss Amanda, you're from Texas, right? Yes, I uh, am. Okay. Best state. Best state. Okay, that's its own particular video series we won't actually go into right now. But uh, it's nice to have you here. Thank um, you. So I have a few questions that I'm sure our audience is dying to hear. Okay. Um, our audience, uh, it's grown from three to four to five or six. So oh, this wow. is great. Yeah, no, it's, yeah. Uh, if you look at the percentages, it's really quite amazing. Our growth. <laughs> okay, so uh, first question, what, what is it like working on the second best authoring tool behind Power BI Paginator Report Builder? <laughs> You know, it's always nice working on a product where we have someone to look up to. Oh, yes, know? that's true. Yes, yes. We are, it's definitely older uh, <laughs> in that, from that yeah, perspective. Yeah, and to make yeah. an older brother, you know. Sometimes the older brother gets jealous on how much attention gets thrown to the younger brother. <coughs> <but> <coughs> that is not necessarily <laughs> the case. But, no, Power BI Desktop has been very, very successful. It's very well. It's not even that old a product. It's only been around, what, three years or something? Yeah, yeah, oh. just about three years. Oh, okay. Have you worked on it the entire time you've been here? Yes, actually. Oh, um, I when I joined Microsoft, I joined a team called PowerView, the product PowerView. Mm -hmm. Silverlight for the win. Yes. Yes, that's true. And that came that came part of the Power BI product suite, and so yeah, I've been working on Power BI since its inception. Oh, cool. Oh, okay. So actually, I just read the Power BI blog, and I noticed that you had another blog post right at the top of the list. Is that right? Yes, oh. I just published a blog yesterday. Oh, cool. So what was it about? We just released our April release of the Power BI desktop. It had a lot of good, exciting features okay. in it. Oh, is there any that you're excited to talk about or would like to share with our audience? Um, it has the first release of our expression-bound formatting features. This oh. is something that lets you take any it's, we're starting with titles, but it will eventually let you take any of the formatting properties in the formatting pane and have it be dynamically controlled based off of DAX. Oh, you know what's interesting? I'm familiar with another product that does a <laughs> lot of expression-based formatting. What could that be? <laughs> oh, paginated reports. Yes, that's right. Are, are you looking to do something similar to what paginated reports has for all of your visual elements? We will definitely be supporting everything to do with the visuals and all the formatting for sure with expression-based formatting eventually. It just take us a little time to get there, starting with titles. Does it have to be DAX? DAX is hard. DAX is hard. Aha! Uh -huh. um, she said it! Oh, Marco Russo is going to be so mad. I think DAX is hard. Mm -hmm. I hear that you're going to do an interview with Will coming up. Oh, I am. And he might have a different answer than me, but personally, I'm a visuals PM. I'm on the visuals side of things, mm -hmm. so... Yeah. I think Dax is a little well, little hard. Well, Will may have a different answer, but it yes. won't be the right answer. Okay. <laughs> so, no, that's really cool. So, uh, so do you like writing these blog posts for each release? Because your name is all over the Power BI blog. <laughs> I do actually really enjoy writing all the blog posts and making the videos that go along with the blog. Uh, it's really nice because then whenever uh, people can recognize my name, and then whenever I'm at a conference or anything like that, the, we have a great community that comes up and wants to start talking with me about all the great features we should, give me new suggestions, stuff like that. Mm. Uh, and by suggestions, you mean criticisms? No, no, they're all just suggestions on how to improve the product and become even better than the best. That is know? very, very well wordsmithed. I, I'm very <laughs> impressed. This is You should be a politician. Okay. So, uh, hey, so uh, being paginated report bear, do you think users would like to see the ability to create paginated reports in Power BI Desktop? I mean... Users want many things. Whoa, whoa, she, she's not biting, no, I'm interested, okay. Because sometimes I, you know, being a stuffed animal and all, hear users saying they might like a single tool to create all their reports in Power BI. 
Yeah, that that is definitely some feedback we have heard. Is that we want to people want a single source of truth in terms of where they go to build all of their content. It's definitely coming up more and more for sure. Yeah, you notice I've taken a more comfy seat on the table because uh, somebody's arm is getting more tired during <laughs> these interviews than he thought about. Okay, <laughs> so uh, so oh, what else are you working on right now for the desktop team? Anything you can share? Ooh, what else are we working on? Oh, there's lots of good stuff that, that's coming out soon. Um, well, that's very vague. Thank you for that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you've already seen a lot with the recent releases, our new filter pane that we've been working on. Mm -hmm. we, have, we have even more features coming to that soon. Sweet. Maybe making it uh, generally available in the near term as Ooh, well. Ooh, that sounds exciting. And so generally available means everybody can get it or it means something else? It means everyone can get it without having to go and turn on any preview features ah. or anything. It's just there for everyone to use. Oh, I'm very familiar with that with paginated reports in the service. It's off by default because it's not generally available. Exactly. That makes sense. Oh, okay. That's very interesting. Thank you for that. We uh, also have our conference coming up soon. Oh, you know, and I've been invited to speak at the BI Power Hour at the conference. Oh, you were? I was, yes. Oh, that's so exciting. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that invitation's still good after these interviews, but we'll <laughs> see. <laughs> so you find my humor more funny than Wukash. Did. This is great. I have a much more friendly audience in this particular <laughs> interview. Okay. You're hilarious. Why would he not think you're funny? Have you met Wukash? Oh, snap! <laughs> Sorry. Okay. So, uh, <laughs> um, being a PM since you've Ben here, what is your favorite feature you've ever worked on? I mean, you used to work on Power View, now Power BI. I think my favorite feature was probably, oh, it's a toss up. I don't know if I, per I worked on both the bookmarking feature in Power BI Desktop mm -hmm. and the report page tooltips. And I love them both so much because it lets people do all these crazy stuff when building out their reports. Mm -hmm. People can make beautiful content, interactive. Well, stuff, you have to remember so. as the paginated report bar. I'm, I'm much more of a fan of static printed <laughs> content. So. Uh, those features, were well, they're nice, I suppose. <laughs> now, I know they've been very popular with the community. They've done some really cool stuff. Uh, my good friend David Elversfeld has done some really cool stuff with those as well. Oh, he has, definitely. Yes. Our, yeah. our community has definitely done some really awesome stuff with bookmarking, report page tool tips. Mm -hmm. And, and static reports, don't get me wrong, they're not bad. Wow, they're that's a ringing endorsement from Amanda Kofsky <laughs> on Paginated Reports. You heard it here. <laughs> they both have their place. I see. Yes, that is a very diplomatic answer. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay, so what's I asked uh, I asked Mr. Wukash this. So uh, what is the hardest thing about being a PM on the Power BI team? Oh, I, for me personally, it's always just figuring out the the right way to prioritize all the different competing mm. feedback that we're getting. You know, we get, with Power BI, we're always trying to pull in feedback from the community. And so we hear things from our MVPs. We have user voice where people can go and vote on suggestions. Mm -hmm. We also hear feedback from some of our biggest deployments of Power BI. You don't say. Customers mm. sometimes provide uh, feedback? A little bit, just <laughs> a little bit. Yes, yes, I've, I've been on some of these calls where we've heard their feedback <laughs> loud and clear. Yes. And sometimes the, the feedback we're getting from different sources conflicts with each other, and so we have to find the right way to balance the feedback we're getting from certain customers versus others. And so it's always a fun balancing act. Yeah, uh, when in doubt, prioritize paginated reports. That's a good, <laughs> it's a good motto to kind of live by. I think that's a great oh, motto Oh, see? To oh, Kim is not going to be happy about that. Oh, man. Okay, so uh, if there's one thing you could improve about Power BI, what would it be? Oh, one thing I could improve. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Careful. I, I think that Power BI is a great tool, uh, but I would love to see even more focus on the visuals and reporting features. You know, mm -hmm. got to have more resources there to add even more control. Really? People expect that. The desktop team has its own floor. You need even more? Come on. <laughs> man, but man. we have uh, our big brother paginated reports to look up to and all of the, all of the formatting controls that you have. Their PM is a stuffed bear. I mean, it's pretty rough down there on the third floor. Okay. <laughs> so uh, that's a very good answer. I appreciate that. Uh, I would have I said something else, but uh, this is an what? open and honest dialogue. What would you have said? I would have said more paginated reports. I'm not <laughs> being cryptic here. Okay. So, uh, uh, so I asked this question for Wukash as well. Um, who makes a better villain, Darth Vader, Amir Nets, or Kim Manis? <laughs> Kim Manis well, being a Mets fan obviously would be the answer. Uh, mm. Ooh, that is true. The answer's Darth Vader. Just move on. <laughs> well, <laughs> I mean, 
I, I, let's go to Darth Vader. Yeah, that's, that's, that's the, the safest answer. one. This was kind that's of a softball that I figured you'd just knock out of the park. But <laughs> it's okay. All right. So, uh, um, who would you like to see as a future interview subject with Paginate Report Bear? Ooh, future interview subject. I think that Paginate Report Bear, since you're, re you're attending MBAS, mm -hmm. our conference, mm -hmm. you need to get with some of our MVPs and interview them. Yeah, they're very grabby. Like, they picking me up and taking pictures. It was really quite embarrassing. You know. They love you. you no, know, no, I, I appreciate no. that. But, you know, I, I do like my space at times as well. <laughs> okay. So, uh, last question. Would you ever consider leaving the desktop team to come work on paginated reports? The PM down there could really use some help. <laughs> um, no offense to the PM on the paginated reports, but I do love working on the desktop team. Dang it. Hopefully I don't get in trouble trying to recruit Miss Amanda away from the team. Okay, well, hey, it has been a real pleasure to speak with you today, Miss Amanda. I really appreciate you taking your time out of your busy schedule. Uh, I know the desktop team is always doing things every month with the every release. Every single crazy. month. It is yes. absolutely crazy, but you're doing amazing work. Uh, I can't tell you how excited I was you were came today, so thank you very much. Thank you for inviting me. I, I would be happy to have you back anytime. Here. Oh, yeah, no, absolutely. <laughs> you always doing a phenomenal work, so we really appreciate it. Uh, coming up next will be Will Thompson, where we'll be going into additional subjects around the desktop and see what his answers are for some of the questions Miss Amanda missed on. I mean, <laughs> I mean, answer. I mean, answer. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay.